Hello everybody, my name is Shadow and welcome back to Doom 2016. We are moving on to resource operations. Broken free from your prison, pitted against evil, the cycle begins anew. To discover the cause of the demonic invasion, first locate and align a communications satellite in the resource operations facility. Know your enemy. Hello, I am Vega, the sentient intelligence assigned to Mars. Hi, God. After running Literally. diagnostics on the Praetor suit, it appears that I can activate optional challenges that, when completed, will assist in upgrading your arsenal at an accelerated pace. I have added a tracking component to your dossier. Nice. So now we have challenges. Two for kill two of the possessed with one trigger pull of the shotgun. Perform five different glory kills on the possessed. Find three secrets. Uh, well, I'm... Oh, that's a lot of secrets. <laughs> Way more than last episode. Now, really quick. Um, I want to double check that the possessed are... Okay, just these guys. So these are the guys I need to do the challenges on. Double check. Because, I mean, there's possessed soldiers. Never know. Let's see if I can gather them together to do this. Yeah, I got him. Where did you go from? Okay. No power. I need to go through here. I need to really focus on those glory kills. Nice. Okay, got that one done. What's our other challenge? Uh, find out three secrets. Alright, we're gonna get that automatically. I can upgrade some things, but I think I want to save them for... Actually, no, I'm 100%ing them. We're gonna get up for every upgrade eventually, so... Reduces the charge time, increases the size, instant load, removes the loading time. I want that. I really want that. Uh, bigger explosion, reduces the recharge time. I do kind of spam it, so let's do that. And then for these, I have one point, so... Uh, environmental resistance... Navigational... How do I increase my... Health Argent cells. Okay. Um, explosive damage, navigation, equipment... Let's do explosive damage, because I... Uh, will probably take damage to these as we go on. Oh, that load time is so nice. This does play something loud, by the way, I think. Um, so just look out. I believe in honesty. Especially now. Yeah, at the end of this message, it's going to play something loud, so maybe turn down your audio if you want. All the rumors. The human sacrifices. Oh, wait, I can crouch, right? Yeah, I can crouch. That's so weird. My sisters and brothers, be thankful. You will be the first. You will have a seat alongside them, just as I will, in what will become the new world that they create for us. Starting now. Jump scare. Yeah, that's the loud sound. Last time I tried to record, it was very loud. I believe you. Did this door open? Nice, nice, nice. Olivia, shut your mouth. Okay, now there's a secret up here somewhere. Uh, I didn't really read that far ahead on the guide. But I think it's this. And that unlocks the old Doom level. Which is down here. Let's kill this guy real quick. 
Oh my god, Olivia, shut up. What is this one? Oh, this is Hanger. I know Hanger. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I don't know the secrets in Hangar, if there's any rooms in here, but I know that Hangar is the first map. That's cool. Where did they put it on the second level, though? <laughs> Alright, what's the third secret? So, yeah, we got the secret room. Uh, yeah, we gotta go get the platform. Continuing the mission, you will come to a room with an orange and yellow door. As you don't have the keys, uh, here you'll need to find another yellow door. Ignore that and proceed with the mission until you reach the yellow key. Once you have the yellow key, do not enter any doors. Instead, come back the way you came from heading down. Okay, that's complicated, so don't do anything until I have the yellow key. Gotcha. I know you can't see the guide. Trust me. I am reading the guide. There's a cue ball. I can launch them. They're very cool. <laughs> Fight him. I'm really bad at managing my ammo here. Can you... can you die? Oh, listen to that music. I think the song for this level is uh, Flesh and Metal. I'm not sure, though. But yeah, Mick Gordon did the soundtrack. Um, uh, if you watch Doom, you probably know there have been some things going on <laughs> uh, recently. Well, not recently, but you know. You, you know. <laughs> With the music. Oh, beautiful chase. I'm gonna view the tutorial because I actually forget how the chainsaw works. Specialized melee weapon, use G. G, gotcha. Using the chainsaw requires fuel, the bigger the demon, the more you need. Cutting apart gives. Okay. One, two, one, three, or five. Upgrading. Okay, it's G. I just gotta remember that. Seriously, look at the environmental design here. It's awesome. Like, there's so much in this room. <laughs> uh, I feel like I was missing something back here. There's also this. Health stations, they're just kind of around. Uh, some users have experienced lightheadedness. This can be cured by reinserting the patient's arm into the machine and running it a second time. This step can be repeated as often as necessary. Oh, that's great. What's this do? Okay, that's what that did, I guess. Seriously, look at that barrel explosion. It's huge. Okay, there's a thing back here. Oh well. Okay, that's one thing I'm you're gonna notice happens to me a lot in this game. When I go into an animation. Um, I feel like I just get hit immediately after leaving the animation. And I'm not sure really what the solution to that is. Maybe just do them less, or do them smarter, probably. Is this a secret? This feels like a secret. That's not the crouch button. <laughs> I have my grenades on control, and I'm used to that in other games, <laughs> being crouched. What? Got stuck for a second. 
enemy bomb. Um, that guy's not having a good time. Yellow security clearance required. Dinner. Yellow security yeah, I, I know. Can't go in here though. I guess this is when I go up actually and over. I know it's yellow, yellow just checking. Okay, I have a chainsaw I can use. That's a thing. When I get the yellow key, I'm supposed to do something. I don't have that yet. I get my health up before I do this. And that was all for nothing. <laughs> Like that, I don't know how to get around that. Because I end the glory kill and just immediately get hit. And I just really don't know how to deal with that. Because I feel like in Doom Eternal, you have like just a split second to get out after doing an animation. But that's not the case here. And yeah, maybe I just spam glory kills a bit too much. We're just gonna chainsaw these guys. I think one of the issues is I'm not moving very smartly, or well, like at all. I am standing still way too much. Ah, oh, I suck. I suck. I suck. It is Nightmare, in my defense, and I told you in the first episode that I'm not as good at this game. Uh, I just gotta get back. It has a different flow. Has a different flow, and I need to start using that flow. Okay, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Man, I am just sucking. I'm so bad. I think what it is, is uh, I'm doing too much looping, and I need to use the barrels more. I think that's the issue here. And I'm also not even using my grenades at all. I always forget about them.
I'm also not using the pickups nearly as well as I should be. Ah, oh, I wanted to like, glory kill him. Okay. And also that hurts me very much. Okay, fourth or fifth time's the charm. Yeah, okay, I'm getting it. I'm getting it slowly, but I am getting it. It's uh, a lot of spacing and a lot of not looping as much as I do in a turn. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. And also not hitting myself with the grenades and also not glory killing everything. Because that's what I'm used to doing. Did... Oh, it's slow. guy I'm following, and another drone. Uh, well, explode, a charge shot, I guess. That's all I have. I don't like charge burst as much. That's a lie. I actually love it a lot, but I mean, what's the... How do I swap weapons? <laughs> yeah, I know what it is. Um... Tutorials. How do I swap my mods? If you have two mods, hit R. Okay. I think F is the BFG in this game, and that's what it is in um the other one. Gotcha. And jump scare. Cool. Okay, now the guide said, uh, once you have the yellow key, do not enter any doors. Instead, come back the way you came from heading down the elevator and turn to the room with the second yellow door shown in the screenshot above. Now, use the yellow key to go inside the room and activate the terminal. Which yellow door? Okay, that yellow door. Back in the area with the, um, the laser grid thing. I need to go back down there to get the secret. Double checking. Gotcha. Okay. It said don't go through any doors yet, and I'm just following the guide, because I don't know where everything is on these levels. No health pickup. Wait. Back down the... Oh, oh, I need to parkour. Gotcha. Wait, how do I... Hold on. Oh, this is open. What does this say? Um, go into the room. Now use the yellow key to go inside the room and activate the terminal. The second yellow door. There's... It just says the second yellow door back here. Um, Access granted. This is the third one, I think. I think that's it. And then I go through this hatch. Yeah, this guy. Nice. This room is very long. Wait, how do I how do I get up? I got the plasma gun! Nice. <laughs> this thing is kind of weak in 2016. <laughs> and by weak, I mean it's a bubble gun. Uh, the plasma rifle stare issue, it's a, it's a gun. It shoots plasma. And now I'm here again. Okay, so once you have the yellow key... Hold on. Okay, that was secret three is an elite guard. Secret four is climb up. There'll be a weapons crate that you can grab for secret four. Secret five, at the weapons crate, turn around the way you just came from. You'll see a platform opposite that you can jump. Okay, I need to go back in there. <laughs> I think. 
it's not letting me go in there we go oh wait hold on that's what it is you can kick the panel out to go back outside now take the elevator back up to where you found the key as you face the key the door on the right in this area will give you secret number five okay well i'm just getting all looped around i guess okay so we go back to the elevator we go back up we do all the things like I'm saying, these levels are really twisty-turvy and require a lot of backtracking for the secrets. Um, and I, I just get really confused by them. Okay, so it says immediately go to this door. Okay, that's secret number five. Uh, now immediately start secret six. Missable. This can be missed if you don't follow and complete from secret five first. Uh, enter the room, follow the bloodstained around to the left. On the lower side, you will see a small tunnel. Enter the tunnel, drop down into the next room to gain six and an elite guard. Aha. Cool. Where's the... This is drop down. Ah, there he is. I didn't see him. Another reason why I'm doing 100% is um, knowing the levels better, and so that I can upgrade faster. Okay. Uh, after this, continue the mission. Once you exit the building to the outside area, make your way to the very back until you find a crate covered in blood. Hold on. When you reach the top on the opposite end. Inside the Vega room is a part of the mission. I'm reading the next. Okay, so we only have two secrets left. Um. Okay. Just check it. Okay, and we're back here. For some reason. Wait, wasn't I supposed to get the door behind that guy? The guy who I got the keycard from? I want to check that really quick. Because I didn't go through there. I think it goes to the same area, but I just want to make sure. There's a lot of fog used in this game. <laughs> Alright, I'm trying to go as fast as I can here, but I'm also, um not gonna really edit these videos so you know raw gameplay full guide walkthrough no cuts <laughs> that kind of thing yeah this door oh I don't want to chainsaw I don't want to before you kill him okay then this just leads down here Oh, okay, that's the difference it made. I also have this thing that I haven't used yet. Access granted. Welcome to the UAC's Mars installation. Located in the vast Hellas Plain impact basin, this high-tech mining and research facility is pushing the boundaries of the imagination each and every day. As a valued employee, your loyalty is more than just a commitment to the UAC. Wait, did it just say I just got dexterity? Where's that? Oh, okay, it's over here. These upgrades improve the speed. Speed! I need speed. Swap weapons faster, yes. Okay, and then upgrades. Uh, I can only upgrade these, and I want to upgrade one of these next. Oh, yeah, it's so much faster. It's not as fast as Doom Eternal, but it's a lot faster. Open the airlock. Okay, so don't I go outside. Hold on. Once you exit the building to the outside area, make your way to the very back until you find a crate covered in blood. Oh, let's check the map. Outside. Very back. I'm not sure what that means exactly. We'll worry later, I have to kill things.
Uh, the crosshair on this gun is like non-existent. <laughs> I can barely see it. I'm going sicko mode. Oh my god, it's so violent. I love it. I love all of it. Here. Here. Here, die. Die. No. Things aren't dying. I can't parkour up there. Things need to die. Come here. <laughs> yes. Yes, more. Nice. I think I need to learn not to glory kill at 100. <laughs> Which I will never do, because it's too much fun. Cool. Make our way around the back of the building, it says. Is this a walkie? It's not a walkie. Wait. Why can't I climb this? No. Okay, that was weird. Let's just make our way around the back. I mean, that's up there. Come on, let me up. Up. Me went up. I can't get up. Alright. Um, this one doesn't have pictures. It just says, go up to the back of the building. Which is very vague. Let me double check. Hold on, yeah. When you reach... Once you exit the building, make your way outside to the very back until you find a crate covered in blood. Climb on the crate onto the platforms above to reach the roof. It's very vague. I don't know. We'll get to it eventually, I guess. The next secret is missable, though. Uh, I cannot enter the door inside the Vega room. As you continue the mission, you will eventually reach the Vega room as you enter the room. Okay. Don't enter the Vega room. Gotcha. Go all the way back. Oh, this back. I remember this one now. Okay. I got confused. Yeah, it's climb the blood crate. Jump up on here. There we go. Yeah, these secrets are really secretive. And also, that is a really good skybox. Get on the roof. And then what's it say? Uh, when you reach the top, on the opposite side of the rooftop will be a small room containing a uh, doom guy. You'll also find the hatch for the next area. This? Yes. Nice. And then this is the hatch I need to get into. Need that <laughs> thank you and now we have the satellite online I think almost here it's a line I'm blocking your access to the facility scanner come to the Vega terminal and I'll give you what you need okay so it says do not enter it as you continue you'll eventually reach room as you enter the room take a left and climb the crates next to the dead body to reach the area that holds a doomed guy. And this is the final secret. Secret 8. Uh, and I think it's an elite card. Nice. Okay, so we have to go to the Vega terminal. And I think there's another fight waiting us outside. No? There it is. That it? Darn. And I'm not supposed to be down here. I've been baited. I really can't wait to get my double jump. <laughs> That's so pretty.
I do not use my grenades enough. Okay, that requires a ridiculous amount of plasma. Do they have a weakness? I want to check real quick. Monsters, possess security, possess security, uh, exhibit complex battle strategies, including mobile shield. Possess security will also drop their shields to adopt more accurate firing stance. Okay, so I can bait them into fighting. Does the weapon specifically state anything? Not really. Okay. So hold on. I saw you. Uh, is enter the room. Take a left and climb the crates. Take a left. Gotcha. Oh, I see it. I saw it on the mini map for a second. You guys were probably staring at it as I was reading the guide, but uh, I wasn't watching the map. I was reading the guide. I don't like these guys. I was hiding in the dark. Take a left. And here we go. Greater token gained. Nice. That should be... What am I missing? Hold on. There's also a weapons cache. I forget about those. Oh, it's a doom guy. Hold on. Uh, I see into the room. Take a left. Wait, that wasn't even a secret. To continue the mission, yeah. Take a left and climb the crates next to the dead body as I enter the room. This isn't the room, though. This is the room. Maybe. I don't know. Take a left. Crates, dead guy. Crates. No. <laughs> what? Why is this room here? Okay, this is definitely the Vega room. Dead guy. Crates. Left. Up. Doom statue down here. There we go. Ooh, it's gold or bronze. Okay, now everything is orange, and we're about to get an Argent cell in here, I believe. Uh, no more pickups. We're good to go. It's a gift. Take it. It will give you strength, help you on your journey, if you can withstand the power surge. Grab. I love the sound that this makes when it breaks. I just love the sound of that. Like the plasticky glass breaking. Just sounds so good. Alright, permanently increases max armor, ammo, or health. We're doing health. <laughs> that is pure Argent energy you've just taken into your system. It seems to agree with you. I will unlock the remaining Argent cells within the facility for you. Vega, give him what he wants. 61,337 UAC members deceased. 81% of the facility is on lockdown. Demonic presence through Mars installation is critical. According to the records, Dr. Hayden, the invasion originated in the Lazarus facility. It seems that a hell wave was activated, transforming 64% of all UAC employees into the creatures you see roaming throughout the facility. The rest were killed by the demons released from their holding cells by Olivia Pierce. Damn it, Olivia. I feel I should apologize for what's happened here. Some of my employees took things too far. 
Olivia was the cause of all this. And I believe you will have to deal with her in time. You may not agree with our research, but know this. We exploited hell and its resources because it was in mankind's best interest to do so. What you now see in this facility is the cost of progress. Huh. But none of that matters now. There is an emergency in the foundry. The regulators have been destroyed and the core temperatures are now destabilizing. They've overrun the adjacent facility. If the venting turbines aren't re-engaged, neither of us will survive the meltdown. Noted. Oh, are you done talking? Alright. Skip for the cause completed. A hell wave. Where am I going? Over here. Things. That's a cool helmet. Oh, it looks nice. All right, just double checking. We are good to go. Know your enemy. Everything is orange. Everything is completed. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe if you are enjoying this content. And I will see you in the next episode of Doom.